do, do you want to start? Yeah. Okay. Me veo, no, ¿verdad? No. Es que cuando me salgo de la aplicación y quiero entrar al WhatsApp, no me veo. Ok, I'm sorry. I, I just... No just a minute. Ok. Tell me. The, the, the... Ok. Ya lo vi. Ok, and right now, yes. Do you, do you have the exercise uh, yet, right, or no? The internet. For me, the internet is revolutioning the world and recently how the world in information and technology. Because the internet has the people to combination and technology and saved study and life. I don't know, it's my, it's okay. my, mm -hmm. yes, yes, yes. The okay. the internet, creo que ha revolucionado, creo que yo que ayuda a, la, a las comunicaciones, a, a los estudios, es una forma de estar en un lugar, pero también dar la vuelta al mundo. Okay. Ah, good expression, Wendy. <laughs> okay. Okay. The second question. Ah, okay. We'll continue with the second. Okay. Do you think any of the future develop will happen in your lifetime? Yes, I do. Lifetime. Uh, How do you mean? It? Sorry. For me, How yes. Do you I mean do. My life, lifetime, lifetime. En el diario vivir, ah, okay. vida cotidiana. Okay. Thank you. El cambio que ha sucedido. De Belém es el desarrollo. Sí. Uh -huh. um, uh, for me, I am already selling in the in, in the occupation for on the on the line because all time. I use the online for me and my work is the fact is the I don't remember tienda is the is the how do you say tienda? Store? A store? A store, okay. Um it's a store, but the pace mm. is in the line. In the coca, the, the tigo money, the other application on the page on the line so for me is more important um, or the future and the, the lifetime okay okay and the the answer the the question is uh, no sé si yo me he confundido dice que si alguno de esos desarrollos que vimos a, anteriores Van a suceder durante nuestra vida, algo así. ¿O cómo es la, la, la pregunta? Es lo que tú piensas de, eh, del desarrollo que está o que está o que está sucediendo y que lo aplica o que lo vas a aplicar. Para ah, ti. ok. Ok. Este, in my case, I think that you, I think the say that it is because in, in this moment, um, we use the uh, we use a lot of internet mm -hmm. and different transactions in our lives yeah. for pay for pay for um, for search information and other things. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Erika. Ya, Erika ya dijo.
Okay, so we are in, well, we'll continue guys with the with activities. So it was a very nice talk and a great conversation we had. And I was listening to the rest of you guys like discussing a little bit about this point. So let's continue with the next activity. And also we have a conversation. So just like uh, check about this picture and look at the following conversation. Uh, the conversation is between Mr. Lee and Karen. So we focus about some vocabulary. So it won't take a time for practicing because it won't be uh, necessary for this. But I just want to um, check this out. They said the neighborhood sure has changed what has what was this place like before, Grandpa? Well, there used to be a grocery store right here on the corner. Mm, it was pretty quiet. Not many people live here then. Um, these days, the population is grown fast. Yeah, I bet they'll tear down all this old building soon. In a few years, they will be just malls and high rise apartments. Hey, that doesn't sound too bad. No, but I miss the old days. So you can see that um, one of the changes about uh, the the future is that buildings, buildings are changing. So the constructions are trying to be much better, to be more natural, to, you know, to improve the, the environment. So you can see that in some places they try to um, eliminate old buildings and start building the new ones, the much better, with better material, not toxic, so with good things. So we can see also the changes about, you know, the features. That's one of the advantages that we can discuss about. Look at the next one. And we have this grammar part. It's, it's a very simple, the use of the past. We talk about the simple past form. That's who say time contrast. Look at this. Okay, so you can check this out here. In the past, not many people live here. So we're talking about neighbor here. So you can see in a place in the past, many people, uh, not many people live here. So we're talking about the past. People used to shop at grocery stores. Now people shop everywhere, even though online, because time ago, shopping online didn't exist but now it exists so uh 50 years ago people live to around 60 uh 50 years ago people lived to around 60 okay so you can see that in the present these days the population is growing fast um as a good example today People shop at supermarkets. It's okay. Uh, a time ago, only in grocery stores. Now they can shop at uh, supermarkets. Nowadays, people live to about 75. So time ago, 60, because there was not advanced medicine. So if somebody needed a surgery in the past, they didn't have the enough technology to make people live longer. Now with technology, with medicine, so people can live longer. And in the future, what is going to happen in the future? Soon, there will be a lot of high rise apartment. So time ago, you know, many, not many people live in a, in, a, in a place. These days, the population is growing fast. And in the future, soon, there will be a lot of high rise apartments. So all the buildings will be up. In 20 years, people might buy groceries by computer. For example, you need to buy something to eat so you can buy it by computers. I think in the, in the future, we think it's advantage nowadays because people can buy it online. So we're not so far away from the future in that area. So we are very close. I want to buy something in China. So I look for and applications, I try to contact the product and I get the product as soon as possible. 
in the future, people are going to live even longer than in the present with the with the best technology we have nowadays. I think technology will be much better. So look how incredible it is, right? So this is how technology is going to be for the future. Okay, so what I want you to do is to take a short time to match the phrases in column A with the appropriate information from column B. Then compare it, well, in general. So before the automobile, what is the possible answer? Before there were supermarkets, what do you think would be the possible answer? About 500 years ago, what happened? In most offices today, in many cities nowadays, soon, in the next hundred years, in the last one, sometimes in the future. So you had to like discuss about uh, this statement. So I will give you some time to try to match the statements, part of the statements of section column A to column B. Take this time. Okay, look at this one and help me with the with the first exercise, guys. So we can compare each other the possible answers we have here in the side. Okay, let's see. Mm, before the automobile, what possible answers we can get from this? People didn't travel as much as from much city to city. From city to city. Either D. Okay, thank you. Let's see what happened here. What about the next one? Before there were supermarkets. Oh, 
They used to shop as small stores. People used to shop at small stores. Small stores. Small stores, right? So that would be letter A. Thank you so much. About 500 years ago, People play the first game, game of golf. People play the first game of golf. Letter G. G. Yes. Thank you. So look how valuable things we can find. In most offices today, letter F. Most people are going to work at home. Most people are going to work at home. See. F. Um, letter C. Letter C. Okay. Letter C. okay. Um, in many cities nowadays, pollution is becoming pollution. a serious pollution problem. Pollution is becoming mm -hmm. a serious problem. A serious problems. Yeah, and definitely. Uh, I, 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 I think. Teacher, the number four is letter F. The number really? four. People work more number than four. 40 hours a week. Four. So in most offices today, number four? People work more than F. hours a week. F. F. More hours a week. So okay. In, in most offices today, people work more than 40 hours a week. Mm, yeah, that also could be a mm. possibility. Yeah, it's, it's, I, yeah. Yes. 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 That makes sense too. That definitely that makes make sense. And it's a little but it can be yes letter. it has more sense because because letter the letter letter c is is writing in in a in a future it's in going the to future, future. Yeah. exactly yes, yes. It's true. and the question is good we, uh, classmate we are to use today <laughs> yes are they, are, they, they are talking today. about the present, the present. Yes. yes yes in most in offices of today so we're talking about the present People work more than 40 hours a week. And also makes yes, sense because true. we're talking about office. Okay. Um, in many cities nowadays, pollution is becoming a serious problem. Pollution uh, is becoming uh, a I, I think uh, it might be, uh, they might find a cure for the common cold because we are talking they about uh, nowadays. They might find a cure for the common cold. Mm. Let's see, because we're talking about a probability about something. Uh, soon. Bless you. And soon, this for example, like future. soon. Um, soon it can be uh, they may find a cure for the common score. Okay. Or okay. can be or can be there will yeah. probably be serious in this space. Also, there is a possibility yes. too. Yes. Yes. That's right. So we can combine some answers, no attached to one answer. So there is a possibility too. But it's more, uh, it is, for me, it's make more sense with the, in the next hundred years. In the next? There will probably yes. be sitting in space. Exactly. There is soon, but no, no, no tanto. I don't know what so is So we the, could say or, this one for H, uh, do you think that, that match? Yes, yes. As, as, the, as the classmates say, yes. And the other one will be probably citizen in, in the space, right? Yes, for me, yes. Okay, it's that's the same more sense. Um, yeah, that's that's not bad at all. So okay. and and then the number and, six, maybe layer layer C. Yes. Soon most people are going to work at home. Also, there is a possibility too. Yes, there is yeah. a possibility too. Okay. Yes, yes. right. Yes. Yeah. So that's why we can combine some possible answers because everything yes. matches. So everything match. So that makes sense to me. And sometimes in the future, what happened? Maybe there will be uh, there will probably be sitting in space. I see in the space. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's true. The only one thing is that doesn't match to me is like sometimes, and in in a moment in the future, maybe also we can use it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So are like future situations. Okay. Thank you so much. And I really like it because we could uh, relate some possible answers that we say, you know what, this could be the answer. But teacher, I think this one also match. So that is one of the goals. Try to identify possible answers for the future. Okay, so 
we don't know what is going to happen in the future, by the way, but nowadays we are watching a lot of changes. Okay, take a short time to develop this exercise. Complete these sentences with your own information and then you will compare. As a child, I used to, so you had to write a sentence or think about something that you used to do when you were a child. Five years ago, I used to do this Bob one. Party. Five years ago, I traveled to Mexico and I had a good time. I don't know, something that you did in the past. Nowadays, I am studying English at this place. I don't know, think about something. Next year, I'm going to graduate from this one or I'm going to finish my career. Or I'm going to get a scholarship. And in 10 years, I will just think about what you will do, okay? So I will give you a, a moment to think about your possible answers for the five statements we have here. Teacher, excuse me, what is the meaning of no, nowadays? In this time, in this okay. moment, in this time. I send you, I send you, I send you a, a, a message nowadays. <laughs> okay. No, recently. Recently. I send you a message. Yes, okay. recently. In, in Spanish, nowadays is like hoy en día. That, that's the okay. Thing. Okay. Thank you. Nowadays. Sunshine, I used to. We can hear you. Did she where you? Excuse me. Are you ready, guys? No? Yes. Okay, so in that case, the last activity before concluding is that we will share in a small groups the, this information you will describe in the five times. For example, as a child, I used to. So you will share with your partner this information five years ago. Nowadays, I next year, I'm going to do this one. I'm going to travel. I'm going to visit. I'm going to leave. I'm going to worry, I'm going to get, so think about in 10 years, I will do this one. So try to give more than one answer because there are a lot of things to do. If you ask me in 10 years, I will do this one. I have different things that I would like to do. So, vamos a formar los grupos y usted brevemente pues eh, comparte la información que tiene con sus compañeros. So we will recreate the breakout rooms to make them small, small groups. So that will be easy because we have a couple of minutes. Okay, so estén atentos para, para recibir la invitación y entrar y practicar, because that's one of the points. Speak. To public, public, eh, 
telephone. But now I use the cell phone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, next year, next, uh, when I was a child, I used to telephone public, public telephone, because I don't know, no, I don't, I didn't uh, telephone in my house, but today I use the cell phone. All the people have a, a cell phone. Okay. <coughs> Francisco. ¿Cómo, cómo, perdón? What about you, as I say, used to? Uh, next year, I used to, uh, I'm going to um, uh, buy the telephone, example, no? Me siento dando la cabeza toda revuelta ahorita. <laughs> Pero creo que ya sería más o menos así, ¿no? Next year, I'm going to the doing the telephone the next year or the going to buy to PC next year. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's my my ID. <laughs> I don't know I don't understand very well, Francisco. Uh, it's more slowly, please. Next year I'm going to Okay. Uh, and next year I going to go to tell nowadays. Um, yes. Yeah. Um, uh, my charm. Uh, as a shy, uh, I used to play with my friends at the at the school every day. Um. Next year, I'm going to study a new course of English. I hope, I hope so. Uh, and five years ago, uh, I, I started to study in the University of the Savior or, or in Spanish, Universidad de Salvador, US. Uh, at the 2017, I started to study to study there. Nowadays, uh, I don't work in because I'm a, I'm a student, I'm a student yet. And in 10 years, I travel for all the world or that's my, that's my dream. Travel, travel to around the world, to all the world to to uh, places like uh, Argentina, Germany, uh, countries um, countries that I like it so much. Okay. Okay. Um, and how are you guys? Fine. I I think the similar. I I and the next year um I will going to travel in the other other country. Me too. What, what country, country do you want to travel? <laughs> Um, South America and in Germany. Uh, we have the same, the same lives. Yes. In what country of the South America do you want to travel? Um... I will visit um, Ecuador, Argentina, and Brazil. I have a friend in Brazil, and they I invited me because I I don't have any money for the travel. You have work. 
a lot of <laughs> <laughs> yes <laughs> eh, and save the money <laughs> Yes, I need to save the money for the travel so that in next. Thank you guys for the opportunity to have been here in the class and also the, the chance to practice English. I learned a lot, definitely. And also I could learn from you and your answers about the future and about the opportunities. So the time has concluded. So thank you so much for the effort and the sacrifice you make every time to stay here on time every day in the class. And also the advance that you have gotten in every single day the practice we have is very valuable for all of us here. So I'm pretty sure that as soon as possible, you will see the results and your English is going to be much better every single time. So thank you so much and have a beautiful night to all of you. See you tomorrow and enjoy your night. Thank you, teacher. Thank you Did you see my... Night, everyone. Night. Have a good rest. Good night. Have a good thank night, you, teacher. too. Thank you, you too. It's a pleasure. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye, teacher. Take care. Bye-bye.